What's up Capricorn? It's me, the Sunlight Oracle here with your quick reading for the dates of May 2021. Glad you could be here. While you're here, please like, subscribe, and share with a friend. It's the easiest way to support the channel. All right, today we're using the Sunlight Oracle deck. These two just, this one came out. Awesome, haven't seen that card in a really long time actually. Um, we're gonna look at the mind, body, and spirit and get you a couple messages here um, that you can refer back to anytime that you need for the month. Also check out your uh, sun and moon sign, or I'm sorry, rising and moon sign if this doesn't resonate. Awesome, I haven't seen these cards in so long. Capricorn, what's going on? You guys feeling like some outsiders? Okay. This is lovely. I actually am getting a real sense of um, peace, self-acceptance, self-possession from you guys, from you folks for May 2021. Um, I sense that recently, and this could be from therapy, it could be from really cathartic relationships that you have with friends or family or loved ones, that you've really um, broken through, you've had somewhat of a breakthrough in terms of sharing parts of yourself with the world. Uh, that were previously concealed. As a result, your body here, your your existence on Earth, um, is very much benefiting. And I'm feeling like a very like a lack of resistance in terms of creativity. I'm feeling a lack of resistance in terms of um, even just like physical mo movement. If anyone's been suffering from like physical illnesses or mental illnesses, um, I'm just I, I sense that. This is kind of, this month is actually like a, a well-earned reward for you Capricorn because you have done a lot of work on yourself. You have done a lot of introspection and you've even taken it to the next level as to where you're sharing it with others shamelessly. Okay, uh, the one the one like real message channeled here from Spirit for you is it has to do with patience, which is just while the flow feels good. Do you see that the mother, oh, this is cool. I don't know if y'all can see this, but um, the Virgin Ma Madonna and Child is here, and Madonna and Child is here. Really lovely. I I'm sensing uh, so much now, but especially in terms of creativity, um, procreation, uh, new ideas, they are coming. So if you don't feel like they're coming quickly enough, that's where Spirit's coming in and saying to have patience, because you have been playing your cards right, Capricorn. You've been playing your cards right. You've been doing everything that um, really I feel like is in in the plan and now the reminder this 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 um, this uh, sorry this message for you is very much just about still sitting tight and unapologetically sitting tight and really like realizing that when you don't sit tight when you when you get all wound up and uh, you, you start to be impatient that all of this beautiful foundation that you've built, maybe some of you have been on vacation, maybe some of you have taken a break from creative projects or business projects and are now returning to them with new energy. When you do that, um, it's all at risk of being kind of, of falling apart when we aren't patient, right Capricorn? So this is the main thing for you to focus on this month is patience, trust in the process, trust that everything you've done so far is great, it's going according to plan, and that I really do sense like a shrinking kind of ego. Cool? Cool. All right, thanks for being here, y'all, and come back next week for um, relationship readings. Have a great day.